Good morning, children! You have learned about place value when you were in grade 2. Now, let's review the topic by answering the exercise. Good luck! Good morning children! How are you today? You already learned about values and place value up to 1000 when you were in grade 2. Now, we will be upgrading up to 10,000. Let's start! Who knows what is this chart called? That chart is a place value chart! Correct! This is a place value chart. In the rightmost column is the ones place. In its left is the tens place. Next to the left, is the hundreds place, then thousands place, and in the leftmost column, the ten thousands place. So, what do you call ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, and ten thousands? These are called place values. Amazing! In the units period, you will see hundreds, tens, and ones, while in the thousands period, you will see thousands and ten thousands. So, let's try placing the digits of 3,508 to its place values. 8 is in the 1's place. 0 is in the 10's place. 5 is in the 100's place. And 3 is in the 1,000's place. Now, it's your turn. Let's try the number 10,000. For a four-digit number, the place values are thousands, hundreds, tens, and ones. For a five-digit number, the place values are ten thousands, thousands, hundreds, tens, and ones. Let's try to answer activity number two. What are inside the place value chart? Those are numbered disks. I'm glad you still remember that. So. What is the equivalent of the number disks? It is equal to 5,372. You're correct! Let's all try to answer. What is the place value of 5? What is the place value of 3? What is the place value of 7? What is the place value of 2? Did you get it all? Now, we will talk about values. To know the value of a digit, the formula is D 
digit times place value equals value. Let's try the number 5372. Let's know the value of the digit 5. So, let's write 5. Since 5 is in the thousands place, we will multiply it by 1000. So, 5 times 1000 equals 5000. The value of 5 in 5372 is 5000. How about 3? Let's write again 3. Since 3 is in the hundreds place, we will multiply it by 100. So, 3 times 100 equals 300. The value of 3 in 5372 is 300. How about the value of 7? So, let's put 7 here, then multiply by 10 because it's in the tens place. So, we have 7 times 10 equals 70. The value of 7 in 5372 is 70. Lastly, what is the value of 2? Let's write 2. Since 2 is in the 1's digit, we will multiply it by 1. So, we have 2 times 1 equals 2. The value of 2 in 5372 is 2. If you will add the values of 5, 3, 7, and 2, it will be equal to the number 5372. So, let's try adding. 5000 plus 300 plus 70 plus 2 equals 5,372. To know if you understood how to get values of a number, let's try another example. We will still use the formula digit times place value equals value. x -real. show me how to get the value of 6. We will write 6 here. Since 6 is in the thousands place, we will multiply it by 1,000. So, 6 times 1,000 equals 6,000. Kenneth, how about number 2? We will write 2 here. Since 2 is in the hundreds place, we will multiply it by 100. So, 2 times 100 equals 200. Angelica, solve the value of 9. We will write 9 here. Since 9 is in the tens place, we will multiply it by 10. So, 9 times 10 equals 90. John Noel, how about number 5? We will write 5 here. Since 5 is in that 1's place, we will multiply it by 1. So 5 times 1 is equal to 5. Adding the values of all the digits will be equal to 6,295. So, let's add. 6,000 plus 200 plus 90 plus 5 equals 6,295. Now, Join us in answering the values of every digit in a number. What is the value of number 6 in 6,437? What is the value of number 4 in 6,437? What is the value of number 3 in 6,437? What is the value of number 7 in 6,437? Before we continue our lesson, let me just clarify some things. 
Many students are confused between place value and value. When what is asked is place value, your answer will only be ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, and ten thousand. Start counting from the right. The first number from the right is in the ones place. The second number from the right is in the tens place. The third number from the right is in the hundreds place. The fourth number from the right is in the thousands place. Finally, the fifth number from the right is in the ten thousands place. Always remember this place value chart. Then, if what is asked is the value of a number, use the formula digit times place value equals value. Again, for numbers up to 10,000, the place values are ones, tens, hundreds, thousands, and ten thousands. And the formula for value is digit times place value equals value. Let's try what you learned.
now, we will be having a short quiz. If you want to take this online quiz, click the link below test yourself. If you want to know your score, click view score after answering all questions. Let's start! If you have questions regarding the lesson in this video, comment down below and we will answer all your concerns. Ba, 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 ba.